in there and three people have been arrested. At this time, we have ruled out multiple shooters. It's still active, but as of right now, we have one person in custody. Was the suspect injured in any way? We don't. I don't have this. I don't have the status of the suspect right now. And there. Do you have any have uh, passed away, sir? I don't have that confirmation. I know we do have injured. I don't know their status or if there's any confirmed killed. As soon as we have that information, we'll provide it. But we don't want to do anything prematurely until we have accurate uh, facts for you. Is there an active search on the uh, Right now, we're clearing all the location. This is a very large area, including the mall, all the retail areas. We are going through making sure that anybody that locked in was that's sheltered in place, that we get to them. We're also treating any persons that were injured in any form. So this is a large crime scene, a large area. So we are systematically going through it and making sure that anybody in the area, number one, we're ruling out that no one is a suspect. And we're also making sure that those people that were separated or hurt are getting the care that they need. Were there casualties in from the Walmart and the mall? I don't have the locations of the casualties. I just know that there are casualties. I don't know the actual, the actual so locations at right now. Yes, there were reports of gunfire in, in several locations, uh, okay. main, mainly at Walmart and the Silla Vista Mall. So are we have getting reports that Bassett was also evacuated? We did have initial reports of Bassett Center. I can confirm that those reports were not true. Uh, we have confirmed that there is nothing going on uh, I, I, uh, related to this incident at Bassett Center. Are the casualties still inside the Walmart? I don't know the status of them. I know medical personnel is, is attending to them. I don't know if they're at the location or if they've been transported. I, I know there's mixed uh, information on that. As soon as I have an accurate count, I will give it to you. What, what, what about reports of one person arrested on their way to Horizon? Um, I don't have any reports of a person arrested in Horizon. I do know that we have one person detained and one person in custody right now. I don't have the location of that of that or where that person was de uh, detained. But as soon as I get that and we, that, we have more concrete information, we will provide it. Do you know voy a hablar en español. Déjame hacerlo en inglés primero y lo hago otra vez en español, por favor. One more time. Initial reports of the weapon was a rifle. I can't confirm that yet, but uh, initial reports was a rifle. Is it true that it was gang-related terrorism? Uh, we have no release, we have no information, and we have not put out a concrete uh, response on what the motive for this shooting is. We are working that. Like I said, we are transitioning into the crime scene phase, and we will be developing more information as that becomes available to us and as we learn it, and we can confirm the it. Scene, sir? Uh, we have, well, the El Paso Police Department has jurisdiction of the city, but we are working with our federal partners. FBI is on scene, uh, DEA, uh, all the federal agencies are here assisting because this is a large area. We do have uh, assistance from the Sheriff's Department, the school district, pretty much every law enforcement personnel in El Paso is here assisting. Uh, El Paso PD will take the lead on it, but we are working closely with our federal partners, our state partners, and all the other law enforcement in this area. You can go ahead. And that suspect in custody, do you know anything about that person? No, we're still developing that. As soon as I have concrete information or an identity of that suspect, uh, I will release it. Do we have a race, age, or sex? No, I don't have anything. The only thing I have is, is a male. There is more than one shooter? Uh, as of right now, we have one person in custody. I don't know the, the, the particulars or if uh, there are more than one. There were initial reports of one, but we have one person in custody. Shall That's the only thing. I don't know the, the ages okay. or the casual count. So there were shots in the mall? No, we have one person in custody as of right now. Did any officers fire their weapon today? As far as I know, no. I don't have uh, any, the condition of any casualties at all, whether they're fatalities or injured. I don't have that yet. As soon as that comes available, we will put it out. I can only say we have one person in custody right now. I can't definitively say there's only one. There were shots fired. There were shots fired in this area. I can't tell you the location, sir. I don't know. I'm sorry, I just need to clarify. But at the beginning of the of the briefing, you said that police have pulled out other people that are not in custody. Okay, just to be clear, this thing is fluid and dynamic as right as of right now. We don't think there's multiple, but that could change. Okay. Uh, initial reports were there was multiple. At this second in time, we have one person in custody. We won't rule out multiple until we have a concrete investigation based on all the facts and investigation of the scene. So it can change. As of this moment, we only have one person in custody. We are investigating the crime scene. Should it change, we will give you an update. But as of right now, that's the information that I have. Okay.